This morning, NBA star Kyrie Irving benched in the wake of tweeting about an anti-Semitic film. The Brooklyn Nets suspending Irving for at least five games without pay after he refused to apologize for posting a link to a documentary that denies the Holocaust. Those falsehoods are unfortunate. And it's not that I don't believe in the Holocaust. I never said that. Irving deleted the tweet last week, but continued to defend his actions. I didn't mean to cause any harm. I'm not the one that made the documentary. He's also resisted demands to unequivocally denounce anti-Semitism. For the record, do you have any anti-Semitic beliefs? I cannot be anti-Semitic if I know where I come from. Late Wednesday, he and the Nets announced they would each donate $500,000 to anti-hate groups. But late yesterday, after once again refusing to apologize, the team finally had enough, saying Irving is unfit to be associated with the Brooklyn Nets. The Anti-Defamation League also speaking out, saying it will refuse Irving's $500,000 donation, tweeting, Kyrie Irving has been given ample opportunity to do the right thing, apologize and condemn anti Anti-Semitism. He has failed at almost every step along the way. The suspension is well deserved. Then overnight, Irving backing down and apologizing, saying, I initially reacted out of emotion to being unjustly labeled anti-Semitic instead of focusing on the healing process of my Jewish brothers and sisters that were hurt from the hateful remarks made in the documentary. Irving says he did not intend to disrespect Jewish culture.